in Doha fourth minstrel conference <coughs> which are held at Doha uh, after two successive failure it was a, a consensus have reached in Doha ministerial conferences so in the fourth ministerial conference in the fourth ministerial conference which was held at Doha consensus have reached between developed and developing countries for the first time developing countries for the first time developing countries benefited by ministerial conferences certain areas which were interest for developing countries were accepted in the Doha ministerial conference that's why we call that ministerial conference or the decision taken in the Doha ministerial conference as what is called as Doha development agenda so very 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 important Doha development agenda which is a, again a current affair whenever you discuss about whenever you talk about WTO this will come Doha Doha development agenda Doha development agenda Doha development agenda in this agenda actually what is this agenda in the 2001 ministerial conference what was finalized in this ministerial conference became the Doha development agenda in Doha development agenda developing countries gained developing countries certain demands were met in Doha development ministerial conference developing countries certain demands were met and that is one of the outstanding thing for developing country in relation to these ministerial conference one where which we'll be discussing tomorrow in detail that a new clause were added in relation to trips the Doha ministerial conference for developing country this was a big success that we were able to include a clause what is called as trips versus public health which I'll be discussing tomorrow what it what this mean is trips versus public health mean is that if a country's public health system is affected due to any epidemic or any emergency then that country can violate can violate trips agreement this was agreed in the Doha ministry so it was a it was beneficial for the developing country so this you keep in mind so trips versus public health were added in the uh, for means this benefit they got second is in relation to see take that uh, page number write down it's very important write it very 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 lot of times you pay you ask this question in mains also page number 18 page number 18 second is in relation to agricultural subsidies for agri subsidies <coughs> who gives more agri subsidies developed or developing country developed countries give more subsidies it was agreed by the developed country even though in the agreement on agreement on agriculture it has said asked developed country to reduce agricultural subsidy they have not done so rather they have increased the agricultural subsidies so in this meeting it was developed countries agreed to the developing country that they will reduce that they will reduce agri agri subsidies so that is again a win for developing countries third is third is this principle got consolidated differential special treatment differential special and pref differential preferential and special treatment differential preferential and special treatment we know that what is differential preferential and special treatment where the developed countries how to if, if if it is in relation to reduction of import duty reduction of subsidy developed countries have to reduce more and in in case of implementation time period for developing country will be more compared to developed country so this is differential preferential and special treatment were imbibed in it so it was confirmed that the developing country will be given differential special uh, preferential and special treatment and fourth one regarding labor issues now keep this in mind uh, once WTO came into existence many developed countries started complaining especially in relation to textile sector or leather industry that child labor is used in developing countries that's why they are by using cheap labor 
they are producing cheap items uh, so there is a gross human rights violation in using child labor so they started bringing these issues labor issues by developed countries but in the Doha Ministerial Conference it was decided that any labor related issues will not be dealt in WTO for labor related issue there is a separate organization what is called as ILO it will be dealt in ILO only so these four things that is in regarding trips regarding reduction of agri subsidy regarding special treatment regarding labor issues it was a win for developing country and at the same time developed countries also benefited developed countries says that okay we can start developed countries benefited in the sense that it says that okay after this we can start a new round of negotiation what do you mean by new round of negotiation where new issues new round means new issues can be added so developing country agreed to the demand of developed country that we can start a new round of negotiation where new things can be added similarly similarly <coughs> uh, regarding industrial duty reduction of industrial goods duty in relation to industrial goods in relation to industrial goods developing countries will reduce import duty on developing countries will reduce import duty on industrial goods so when developed countries will reduce agri subsidies developing countries will reduce industrial goods uh, import duty then in regarding Singapore issues Singapore issues which were dealt especially trade facilitation agreement which was dealt in the Singapore ministerial conference developing countries agreed that okay we, we will consider the issues which you brought in the Singapore ministerial conference so Singapore issues uh, were taken on board by developed countries into WTO agenda now regarding environmental concerns environmental related concerns which is a concern for developed countries were agreed by developing countries so regarding labor issue it said that WTO will not deal it regarding environment related issues it was agreed that WTO while dealing in trade in whatever items that the environmental concerns will be taken care of so in one so because of this uh, <coughs> since both the both the group that is developed and developing world benefited from this minstrel conference and it was compared to the earlier conference it was basically development oriented not only development inclusive development oriented that's why this public health or trips related were allowed so the decision made in the fourth minstrel conference were called as heralded as Doha development agenda now after this what happened is that developed countries withdrawn from their earlier commitment and now they are not following what so they in every minstrel conference developing countries will come and say that why you are not implemented then developing developed country will say that you implement first this then nobody will consider that but actually what happened is one good thing happened with Doha is that we have used this trips versus public health provision in a good manner that is only success especially for India in relation to Doha so there are but developed countries have not followed in spirit what were done in what were what the decision made in, in relation to reduction in agricultural subsidies they have not done it in relation to uh, preferential treatment they have not done it you might have seen that many of the countries restricting India certain items by again talking about labor related issues even though it was dealt uh, clearly mentioned in Doha around that it will be dealt by ILO so Doha development agenda the things uh, issued is very important even though it happened in 2001 in all the ministerial conference this issue will be crop up again will be cropping again you see the 2016 mains question <coughs> the broader aims and objectives of WTO are to manage and promote international trade in the era of globalization but the Doha round of negotiation seem domed due to differences between the developed and the developing countries discuss in the 
Indian perspective. So you can you can take all these issues and discuss it. So here India's interest need to be taken care of. So that's why this is very very important. 